Welcome to today's Pocket Informant video on how to use Travel Assist. Planning a trip is exciting. Often our travels take us to places far away in different time zones. When traveling across time zones, it can be confusing both to plan the events of a trip and calculate the time zone differences. Pocket Informant is a great tool to help you with managing your calendar when traveling. Pocket Informant includes a one-of-a-kind feature to automate your time zone management called Travel Assist. We'll show you how it works. In essence, the Travel Assist feature will block a section of your calendar for your trip. Events created in this blocked area, once saved, will show you both your current local time and the local time of the event in your destination time zone. Once you are in your destination time zone, the events and informant will display correctly in the local time. While at your destination, if you schedule events outside of your travel date range, Pocket Informant will show you those events in your home time zone and will display them both in local and the home time zone to ease confusion. Now, let's walk through the steps. For this video, we will be using an iPhone 11 Pro with iOS 13.2.2 and Pocket Informant 5.54. Travel Assist in the Android version of Pocket Informant operates in a very similar fashion. To begin, open Pocket Informant. To access the Travel Assist feature, go to the Settings, Calendars, Triggers, and more and select Travel Assist. Tap the Add button to create a new trip. Tap the City field to set the city nearest your desired destination. Next, choose a trip color. This color will be used to shade the calendar or the text for the travel period depending on how you have Pocket Informant configured. Now, we will set the arrival date and time for our destination. And below that, we will set our leave time. This is the time and date that we are leaving our travel destination. Once you save the trip, the application will show you two clocks that indicate the time variance between your current home time zone and your destination time zone. Tap the back button to exit and then dismiss to get back to the calendar view. Now, as you can see in the month view, our trip time is indicated with a spanning label across the days for the duration of our trip. Again, this is a settings preference. Now, if we select one of the days of our trip and add an event, you can see the time zone has been set to our destination, so we would enter our event for the local time of our destination. For example, if we wanted to go to the museum at 2 p.m. in our destination, we would enter that time for the event. Then we would fill in the rest of the event details as normal and save. Now, since this event is occurring during our trip, if we tap on it while we are still in our home time zone, the summary view will show us the times for both our home time zone and our destination time zone. Now, through the magic of video, we are in our destination and having a grand time, but we realize we need to schedule a dentist appointment that will occur after we return home. So now we go back to our calendar and recreate the event as we normally would with one extra step. Notice in the date and time picker we now have to tap the time zone field to set our home time zone for this event. Then save. Now because we are still on our trip when we tapped the event, you can see that in the summary view, it shows us the event in our home time zone. 
and our current time zone which is still our travel destination. This valuable feature can take a lot of the guesswork and headache out of your travel plans while you are on a trip. If you have any further questions on the Travel Assist feature, please feel free to contact our support team. You can also open a support case in-app from the settings area or go to pocketinformant.com forward slash support and open a support case there. Our team will be happy to assist you. Thank you for being a Pocket Informant customer and please have a productive day. Thank you.